Yo, what's going on guys? It's your boy Brother Shield. Today we're gonna come back to the CSU emulator and we are gonna do another test. So today we are gonna test out Luigi's Mansion 2. So without further ado, let's begin. So I'm gonna do things a little differently this time. Um and then I'm gonna do a little intro. Well, no, this is the intro. I'm gonna just talk during the beginning. Uh, and unless there's something happens during the recording, I'm going to pretty much mute myself and then I'll talk about my experience at the end of the video. So this is just a quick test. I hope you all enjoy this test. I'll see you on a bit. Okay, this is not how the first test I expected it to just pause or freeze right there. Give me a sec, guys. I may have to just scrap this and do another video. Uh, no, cancel. What the hell is going on? You mean to tell me this thing can't boot Luigi's Mansion? Ah, oh, great. Just great. Not a good start. Come on. Good Lord. Not good. really bad. We are not getting some good speeds. 10 frames per second. And I can barely hear the audio. This is really bad. So right now it's saving. This is coming with emulators. It does slow down. Now let's see if we can get into a gameplay. So this is definitely going to be a real quick short video. I wasn't expecting uh, the stream to go this bad because I like to well I like to boot it for the first time while recording this is not good come on just one more extra frame there we go okay 15 we got that little boost there
Okay. At least some parts are rendering. There's a lot of starters. The game is running very slow. Uh, I just hope it doesn't stay stuck at a particular point. Because I'm just hoping we can move past you know, all the starters and at least try and get into the gameplay before we end the video. Because I don't think uh, this will be a long test. Depending on how the starters work. Okay. So definitely not playable, we're not getting good speeds, uh, this is running on the Nvidia Shield TV, so we're really not getting good speeds. Some games will run better, but uh, I think most of the heavy games, they don't uh, run that well. And this is the MMJ build, oh, okay, I'm watching those FPS. really bad so there's not much vertex explosions as uh, some of the other emulators but uh, all that really is now is just speed so there's the dark I don't think I can skip the cutscenes because I really want to get into the gameplay or well, if I do it's taking forever Let's see if I can skip it. Nope, I can't skip. New ghosts.
Bruh, if I'm being honest, my goodness, it's already been almost... Jeez, 30, oh my god, oh my goodness. Anyways, guys, I'm going to pretty much end the video here, because I think I'm just going to get the same results, if I'm being honest. Bruh. So, Luigi's Mansion 2 is definitely not playable, so we will not be coming back to this game for a good long while, probably for the next two, three years, or... Uh, or at least until Citra does one hell of an update. So anyways guys, this was a test on to see how Luigi's Mansion 2 ran on the Citra emulator on the Nvidia Shield. So far, this was not, well, this was not a good run in terms of the performance. But in terms of everything else, everything is rendering. So let me know what you think about this test in the comments below, guys. If you have guys have a test you want me to run on the Nvidia Shield, please let me know in the comments below. And uh, make sure you follow me on library slash odyssey. That is where most of my focus is going to be. And until next time, guys, this has been your boy, Brother Shield. Take care. Peace. <laughs>